face that this world has forgotten. What's up guys and welcome to my Like a Rock Stat Theory Speculations. Now, as you guys may know, you know Midnight Forum and um, Midday Forum has gotten, of course, another forum called the Dusk Forum for Lycan Rock, which is really cool. I'm actually like that this Pokemon gets some new love. It, it definitely wasn't what I do believe Game Freak wanted it to be, which was, of course, you know, a gimmick that for a viable Pokemon should have been interesting. It wasn't that for the life of me. They actually definitely screwed this Pokemon of some fame, and yeah, we're gonna go over why it fails so miserably, and also why a new form could be important for that very reason. Now, before going into this, you know, as, as you guys already seen, many people did videos about this, you know, oh, a new reveal, whoa, hype. Um, I'll, I'll try to avoid these videos when I don't think it can bring anything to the conversation, but one thing I really can do is talk about what I hope this Pokemon will be in the future. And if you want to do videos like that, you kind of have to wait a few days. You, you really have to make that hype dust settle and uh, that is basically what i'm trying to do here well <laughs> because i really think those videos can be really really brain dead that's <laughs> what i'm trying to say now before going into the video i really have to of course uh, go over what i would see is the elephant in the room which is the design of the pokemon itself yes i was really disappointed by the sign um I don't think the signs ruin a Pokemon necessarily because a new form really means a lot for it and we definitely can see something new happening with this Pokemon. That definitely should be stated. But the disappointment about this Pokemon was definitely that it looked too much like the midday form. And I get that. I think if there's um, going to be a combination of the both of them, it really should have looked like both of them. It looked definitely more like the midday form than the midnight form. And I think the issue wouldn't have been so bad if the Midnight form looked a lot more like the Midday form. They are so vastly different between one another that I believe that the Dusk form really just looked too much like the Midday form. That said, I don't know how it should have looked like. I definitely want to state that. that it's important to actually say that you are disappointed about a form and uh, you know, can pinpoint why you think so. Uh, I think that showcases you know, your expectation and the love for the game. That said, it won't matter in the grand scheme of things. In the end of the day, the design only matters so much because in the end of the day, as a Pokemon player myself, I really just want the Pokemon to be good. That And that's really what it's all about. So with that said, I did a um, bit of a take on this video like I do with the Who is Really Better and um, was trying to define how the new form could look like, how the stack could be distributed and just overall, how I think this Pokemon will um, work. We actually already got a few confirmation in a new ability of Tough Claw, or not new ability, but this is its ability. Um, so this is definitely one of the good things, and the other ones being, of course, that uh, it gets Axilla Rock and Counter. Counter clearly not mattering a whole lot, but Axilla Rock, yes, two Pokemon with this, nice. So with that said, let's of course look over them and see what I think. Now before going in, you know, talk about the new form, I'm really just going to state the issue with the two forms that are at the moment, and I think why they fail so miserably. And it comes actually down to, you know, their regular abilities, you know, the No Guard and uh, the Sand Rush abilities here. Uh, they are incredible in every way, I just believe they should have been flipped. I do believe uh, the regular Lycan Rock would have been a much, much better Pokemon with No Guard over Sand Rush, and of course Lycan Rock Midnight, due to being slower, would have been a much, much stronger Pokemon because of Sand Rush. I do believe had that solved that, that would have, we would have been having a very, very different experience with these two Pokemons. Now, with that said, you know, I'm gonna go over what I think gonna happen to the Dusk form of Lycan Rock and just overall what I think could happen besides that, because there have been some rumors while we're gonna treat this as a Soul Rock type till it actually is released, one has speculated that it could be a rock fairy type, so therefore I decided to put the weakness graph down there. But as stated, it's going to be treated as it is, which is a soul rock type. So treat it as above there, this is the issues that a rock type are carrying. Now with that said, uh, what I think gonna happen to um, Lycan Rock's Dusk form is that it gets the peak stats of the Pokemon itself. Uh, it's like I said before, very important that we get this, of course, quote unquote, signature moves of each form, which is Axilla Rock and um, uh, Counter. Best at it, Counter, not as interesting, but at the same time, ah, nice, cool, whatever. Um, what I think is gonna happen is, as I said, that the peak stats of each Pokemon is going to be transpired for. Um, so for a midday form, we're going to get 112 in its speed. Um, this is something that got split on the midnight form on the defenses. So 
uh, while it kept the 82 base speed on the midnight form, it got uh, instead of 65 in its defense and 75 in HP, it got 85 and 75 in its defenses. I think these are also going to be carried over. Uh, at least this is what I hope for. I hope it gets the best of both forms, so they don't do like a half-ass thing and just split everything and just becomes uh, you know a base 102 speed Pokemon already. And I'm like no, don't do that. Uh, I really believe this is this is how it's going to look like. And a tough claw is a very very good ability. I really hope outside of that that it actually gets. Um, does both get canine? I kind of get, or I can. It should get since you know it's a canine. Haha. <laughs> Pokemon. So Kenai is probably going to be a thing here and most certainly and I really hope the last ability gets is either No Guard or um, uh, what do you call it? Um, sorry, No Guard or the Vital Spirit. Uh, that said, um, No Guard is definitely a more desirable one. If we get Sand Rush, that's fine. If we get two new, completely new abilities uh, in Bond with it, that would be just as exciting. Though No Guard is due to Stone Edge, a lot more desirable thing. Now, Tough Claw is a bit more interesting actually because Tough Claw actually boosts Accelerate Rock move. Uh, there are very few stone moves that does that. Accelerate Rock is one of the few. So, having that boosted is very, very, very good. Um, another move I was really hoping this Pokemon would get was Technician. Uh, Technician would boost at the same time as Tough Claw is really doing the damage output of weaker moves. Uh, Tough Claw is boosted actually by its Fang moves, you know, Crunch with Fire Fang. We have. Uh, uh, what's that? Thunderfang, Firefang, Thunderfang, yeah, and Crunch. And then we have you know, the likes of Brick Break and do we have Sucker Punch. There's a lot of moves here that could be interesting with Tough Claws in mind to get those boosted because of Soul Stance in mind. It kind of does boost it to superb levels. That said, I wouldn't be surprised if this Pokemon got Strong Jaw possibly, though if uh, the Midnight Form didn't get it, then I guess it makes no sense the Lightning Rocks, Dusk Forms get it. But that is basically what it is at. I really hope, as stated, that this is what we're looking at. And if it gets the Fairy Typing, which I said here, I think it's highly unlikely, but I want to treat it here because of the rumors kind of pushing it to be there. But as I said, there are rumors, and trust me, at best, you know, we, we should take it with a grain of salt. But if that's where to come to fruition, I really hope it should get play rough, right? And tough to boost to play rough would be pretty darn cool. <laughs> I would love that. Jam, that would have been so cool. But that said, it has to be treated like a soul rock type. I think it's going to be a soul rock type, but it wouldn't have been. The worst thing in the world have actually become that. I think that's a decent thing for it to get. That said, that's pretty much my speculation for it. Let's say that this is stats we're looking for. Um, if it remains a soul dark type, I do believe it's going to be pretty subpar anyway. But with Tough Claw and of course the likes of Accelerock, it's going to be a much, much better Pokemon than the two other forms are. Um, it also should be said that. Um, I really hope with the Mewtwo the moves that it does learn a lot more, and I really hope we get access to Ice Fang. I think had it got an Ice Fang or Ice Punch or whatever really, just an Ice move in general, this Pokemon's viability would have pecked a lot higher. Uh, because it has a strong speed tier, it has a strong attack stat. Um, if it has this speed tier, uh, <laughs> also should be said that this is going to be a much much different Pokemon in the meta. I mean, with ice, an ice move in mind, this would have pushed the viability of this Pokemon, so I really hope we're going to see that. If not, it might actually as best turn to R U U. It probably was going to say in you. That is definitely my hopes that it doesn't. I don't, I don't think it belongs there. You upgrade this Pokemon to become better. Do not make it rival his own keen, is what I'm trying to say. This is definitely a uh, Pokemon that should have been a lot better. I think Game Freak had a lot more wishes for this Pokemon. And then actually, it's a very, very mediocre Pokemon at best. So I really hope this form solves this issue, and I really hope, as stated here, that they do preserve the things that make the other ones good, remain its peak stats, and solve this issue. And this Pokemon should be fine. Really looking forward to seeing this Pokemon in the well in November, and I really hope we get some more news of its possible abilities. That's it, guys. As always, thank you for of course watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye.